So life on the lake. Get the bikes out, take them for a ride. You've got the water, you can go out and kayak. You can go for a walk. It's a great place to just get away and relax. There's a reason why people like to come out to the Finger Lakes, spend some time during the summer. Cayuga State Park, which is located on Cayuga Lake, which is one of the Finger Lakes located in Seneca Falls, New York. And this week we're doing lake life. Right. So we did have a chance the other day to do some kayaking, which was the first time we've done it since the summer. And uh, it was very nice. It was a beautiful day. The lake was calm. So we took advantage of it. Lake Cayuga in the kayak. Look, they have unicorns in a spot. Just riding along, checking out the shoreline, all the cottages and such. Nice day on the water today. Yeah, not too warm. There are some clouds, puppy clouds. Yep. But not bad at all. Yeah, it's a, I mean, it's a nice park and we've never been on this road. No. Much, well, I don't know if it's quite as big as uh, Seneca, yeah. but it's a good size and it goes quite a way. It goes, what, 30 miles? Yeah, all the way to Ithaca yep. on this end. Where does it start? Right up here. There's really not a city up there. No, right up that way. Yeah. The north end. Yeah. South end has Ithaca and the north end is really not connected to a city. It's kind of near Seneca Falls. Yeah. But Seneca Falls isn't really on the lake. So we finally got to do some kayaking this week. Yeah, we went on Tuesday. Yep. It was, yeah, it was a beautiful day and the lake was nice and calm and very warm. It was like in the 80s. Yeah, I think they said the water temperature is like 84 degrees here. So it's really, really nice. Probably great for swimming too. Uh -huh. Yep. And the marina that we're standing at is located right adjacent to the park. So it makes it very convenient to come. We've also done some bike riding today along the um, road that's right along the park. Yep, the and, Lakeshore Road or whatever we call it. Uh -huh. Yeah. So we rode along there and just... And we rode through the park and underneath the main road through a tunnel. Right, there is two sides to this park. Um, the, it is split by the main road. So we rode around there. It's, an, it's a nice camping area. It wasn't very full. The only thing about it is there is no electric. 
It's on the other side of the road. Right. 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 It's, right. Not, it's not the side we're staying in. Right. Uh, the side of the park that we're staying in does offer electric on all their sites. Right. Right. And so we have electric on our site. Um, we're up on a hill. The only downside to our campsite, I think, is the proximity to the road. And we hear the right, traffic coming right. through quite a bit. It's a yeah. busy road. Right. Our site is right along the main road. Yeah. And there's a lot of trucks and stuff that come through. And a little bit noisy. But yeah. you get down here, we're by the water in, the, in this section of the park. It's nice. Yeah. And it wasn't bad during the night when you were trying to sleep. No. It no. It kind of calms down. You don't. They don't seem to be traveling through as much. So. Right. So it's not so bad. Yeah. So it was a nice sight. Yeah. Yeah, like all parks, there's a lot of places you can go walk, and it looks like there's some hiking back on the other side of the road. It, you know, we didn't get a chance to do, but you could do that. And the dogs have enjoyed it. When we're camping, they always get to go for plenty of walks and see different sites. has a very nice playground which is right across the road from the campground and right next to the playground is the beach area and swimming area. How do you like your stay at uh, Cayuga Lake? So far it's been very nice. I mean it's a very nice park. We'd never been here before. No, it's our first time. And uh, so we decided since we're staying in New York State for the summer. Staying local. Staying local. Uh, we decided last week we're at Samson State Park on Seneca Lake. And so, we're supposed to have video up here. Okay. Uh, this week we decided to come down to the next uh, Finger Lake, Cayuga Lake. And they also have a state park that does allow camping. It's not a huge camping area compared to Samson, but um, it, it's a nice camping area. They mm -hmm. have, it looks like they have. You know, if you don't have an RV or tent or any type of that, um, they do have camping cabins as well. Yeah. And there are different sizes. The one is pretty good size. It looks like a small house. Yeah. A lot of them look like they're just like one or two be rooms, but there is a couple pretty large ones. Yeah. They do rent those out. Um, yeah. And they have, what, about 25 or 30 sites with electricity where we're at. No sewer, just electric. Just electric, no sewer or water. Which is fine. <laughs> they want to play. Auntie, you are the noisy dog. So, where were we? Oh, talking about Cayuga State Park. Right. And Cayuga Lake. Yep. And they do have, you know, a beach area today. The beach was open. Yep. Yesterday when we got here, it was closed, I guess, to, due to algae. But today it was open. Yep. It's a nice little area. And there is a lifeguard. Right oh. now we're just taking the dogs on their evening walk. And they just finished roughhousing a little bit. Yeah. They usually have to get, you know, when we're at home, they do do that, you know, a fair amount during the day. Yeah. Monty's still a puppy. 
yeah. Well, in, a, in his head. Right. So they get to running and rolling over and, you know, kind of not vicious playing, but they do get to growling and barking. Our stay here at Cupid Lake has come to an end. Yep. It was a really nice time. Yeah, we enjoyed it. Yeah, nice few days to get away from the house. The house. Right. Relax and enjoy some peace and quiet. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And, and subscribe to our channel. And make sure to hit the bell for notifications so that you know when we post new videos. We post new videos on a weekly basis and we'd love to have you follow along with our journey. So, come on guys. Time to jump in the truck and go. Come on, little camera, you gotta come with us.